You know, it's no secret that the internet is a great but a scary place at times. As long as the sun continues to rise, the most cunning amongst us will continue to scam. Most recently, a 22-year-old influencer from New Jersey is accused of stealing more than a million dollars from her social media followers and local businesses. On February the 13th, federal authorities in New Jersey arrested and charged Kayla Massa, also known as at K Oldie to her 300,000 followers. You know, uh, her Instagram account is now private after being caught in this scam. According to a complaint unsealed in, in the New Jersey Federal Court, Massa orchestrated an illegal scheme through which she scammed over 45 of her unsuspecting social media followers, many of whom were under the age of 18. And guess what? She scammed them out of a million and five hundred and five hundred thousand dollars. And according to a recent court investigation, Massa would post photos of money orders and stacks of cash on her Instagram stories with dubious messages like, if you've got a bank account and you're interested in making legal money, hit me up ASAP. Then the complaint alleges that Massa would encourage those individuals to empty out their bank accounts before providing the debit and card, uh, like sorry, the debit card numbers and PIN numbers to falsely allay fears of losing money. Next, she would allegedly deposit large fraudulent checks using the names of real businesses into her followers' accounts and then withdraw the cash before the bank would flag or retract it. By the time her victims had caught up and uh, known that something was afoot, Massa would then block them on social media and where her and her other alleged nine conspirators would show off with uh, things that they had bought from the ill-gotten money. Meanwhile, Massa's victims would be left with overdrawn accounts. As a result, many victims were forced into payment deals with the targeted companies and the debit cards were cancelled. In some cases, the businesses whose names were on the fraudulent checks also lost money. Unsurprisingly, it didn't take long for the authorities to catch up to the scam. In July 2018, the U.S. Postal Service learned that more than 50 blank money orders had been stolen from the New Jersey Post Office, which sparked an investigation and turned up surveillance footage of Massa and her nine alleged accomplices in the stores. So now the suspected crime group is facing charges of conspiracy to commit bank and wire fraud. So people better wise up 